first uh, is from Brian Matthews. Hey, Owen, uh, thank you for speaking to us. Um, wanted to ask you about uh, third down uh, defense when you see other teams converting, you know, over 60%. Um, what does that uh, do to you as, as a defensive player? Uh, it, it was definitely hard hard to see that out there. Uh, it was a struggle, but you know we gonna we regrouping and practice this week, and we gonna make sure we we never see anything like that again. We gonna get that corrected for sure. And as a quick follow up, what are some things you need to do better when you when you look at the film? What are some things y'all aren't, aren't getting done on third down? A lot of things throughout the whole game, not even just third down, was just the little things um, throughout everybody's assignments. So just p looking at the small details and everything, making sure everybody's in their gap, uh, right, leverage on coverage, you know, things like that, just sharpening up on that. But like, like I said, we're going to make sure we get all that corrected. Thank you, Owen. Next is Jordan Hill. Owen, how happy have you been with the response you've seen from everybody on defense so far uh, this week in practice? I'm actually really proud of everybody. Like we all know, uh, we all know, like our performance uh, Saturday wasn't really, wasn't Auburn football to the standard that we should have played at. But you know, we're looking past that; it's behind us now, and we are uh, looking at it to just learn from the mistakes that we made to make sure that we don't ha uh, have a bust like that again. Next is Justin Ferguson. Hey, Owen, what are your uh, initial thoughts about Arkansas on offense, and kind of what the challenges they might bring this week, deal? Uh, I think they got a. Uh, I think they they look better than what they have in the past uh, few years. Uh, definitely better from last year. Uh, you know they got a new quarterback in Felipe Franks. He's a really talented guy, and I think he's uh, brought that offense together and got those guys to play hard and play together. So um, I think it's going to be a pretty good game for us, and we we, are, we gonna have to give them all we got because I know we're gonna get their best shot. Next is Jason Caldwell. Oh, and how how tough is it to balance the? Uh kind of get mad and, and, and kind of get that mad on, but not let Nick said, as Nick said, not letting Georgia beat you twice. How, how hard is it to balance that this week? Uh, man, it's just just uh, one one game at a time, man. Like what happened, it happened. You know, there's nothing we can do to go back and fix it. But uh, what we can do is uh, learn from our mistakes and just make sure, like like things that we messed up on last game, that we don't do that this game. But just take it one play at a time and, and just dominate. That jumps out to you, that you said, man, we got to get better at this area. Yeah, yeah, d definitely. Any, any, I say anything you saw that you said, man, we got to improve here. Anything specific? Uh, yeah. Definitely, uh, third down defense and stopping the run. Just making sure everybody's in their gaps and everybody's uh, um, executing their assignments. Thanks, man. Next is Nathan King. Hey, Owen. Hey, thanks for talking to us. Now with two games that you've seen from them, what have you kind of observed from the new guys along the defensive line, and how have you kind of seen them come along? Yeah, we definitely got guys. Uh, we we actually don't have that much experience on the D line, but um, I know they they come even just from this practice that we just had. I know they uh they taking responsibility for what happened, uh, and everybody's making sure that we taking their next step. Another one from Jordan Hill. Oh, and I wanted to ask about KJ. We talked to him after that game on Saturday, and he was talking about his hand and his shoulder was beat up, but you know it seemed like he was gonna. Pretty much had to be dragged off the field to quit playing. Just what does that say about him? His determination and his leadership on defense. Man, that's a dog, man. I got I got a lot of respect for KJ. Just him fighting through the pain that whole entire game. Because you know most guys they would have just just came off if it was something small, just just to get out of that. But uh, you know KJ got a lot of heart and he played through it, man. And he, uh, he's gonna get better. Next is Gianna Hahn. Hey, Owen, how's it going? Um, does Chad Morris's familiarity with the personnel on Arkansas's offense help you guys in your preparations at all? Yeah, definitely. He lets us know, you know, what kind of players uh, all those guys are. So it just gives us a, a better insight of who, who we uh, playing against. Any other questions for Owen? All right, Owen. Thank you very much. Appreciate your time tonight. Thank y'all for having me.